What's up with y'all? Welcome back to the channel. Hope your day is going good. Hey, how to survive a tiger attack. We gotta survive, y'all. We gotta we gotta live to tell a story, you know what I'm saying? So we're gonna watch these steps, get into it, see what's happening. And you already know. Also, drop some questions for my QA video I'm gonna do. Make sure you put some questions out there you would like to know about so I can answer it for y'all. But let's get into this video. Here's how to survive a tiger attack. Remember, it's not just humans that are at a disadvantage in a tiger attack. A 2011 incident where a tiger killed a lion with one swipe should oh, wow. you how deadly these creatures can be. Oh, wow. These are impressive. The largest tiger in history weighed 550 kilograms. And a 1,200 pounds? I don't even weigh 200, man, so I got to be smart if i see a tiger you know what i'm saying i gotta maneuver and stuff i gotta be like what's good g can't be scared either what's good yeah gotta be hard man gotta be tough tiger is 70 percent muscle mass can weigh up to 360 kilograms and measures 3.2 meters long okay. and tigers have 17 centimeter teeth and 7.5 centimeter claws a tiger can behead a human with one swipe. The largest of the tiger one family, swipe? the Siberian Amur tiger, averages around 300 kilograms. The male Bengal averages around 270 kilograms. If you're thinking of running away, tigers can run up to 64 kilometers an hour. According to the book, Tigers of the World, 373,000 were killed by tigers between 1800 and 2009. To avoid becoming part of the first of all why are so many of y'all dealing with tigers why are you messing with them things let them be them stay away from them please please it's not that serious gruesome body count what should you do how about climbing a tree should you go limp and hope it thinks you're dead what happens if you fight back Step one. All right, step Stay one. Quiet. All right, we got to be quiet, y'all. If you're lucky enough to see the tiger before it spots you, stay quiet and don't move. Okay, all right. Movement will alert the tiger and turn its deadly attention to you. Even okay. If the tiger looks old, injured, or sick, it is still a threat. Even the weakest <laughs> tiger... Did you hear that? Old, injured, or sick? What am I doing then? What am I trying for? The dude is going to attack me anyways. Extremely dangerous. They have less ability to hunt big animals, but you're an easy target. Step two, inhale deeply. <sighs> Panicking is the worst thing you can do. This is not a good time to give in to your fight or flight response. Back away slowly without making eye contact and do not show your back to the animal. As soon as the tiger is out of sight, get out of there as fast as you can. Okay. If the tiger okay. spots you and you are with a child, put it on your shoulders. It will make you look bigger and more intimidating. The same goes for if you have an adult with you and can get them on your shoulders. Do anything you can do to make yourself look larger so the tiger thinks you're a threat. Stand tall <laughs> and puff your So you up. telling me if me and my friends are getting attacked by tigers, I will put them on my shoulders and be like, bro, you got to be... The meanest looking thing I ever seen in history. You gotta look tough, bro. You gotta be hard. You gotta be amazing. You gotta do what you gotta do, man. Cause we gonna survive this, man. I, I'm telling you, man. Me and my friend or whoever with me, trust me. You with CJ? We gonna make this. We not letting no tiger take us out, or at least be easy. You know, we gonna go out like champs. Don't crouch or sit or do anything to make yourself look small, as that will encourage the tiger to attack you. Step four, hold your pee. Hold your pee. <laughs> no matter how scared you are, do not pee your pants. Tigers are attracted to urine. The tiger might think you're marking your territory and take it as an act of aggression. That Bro, you can't even pee? That's something I even think about. But you cannot pee? Okay. Okay. Don't pee. Just don't pee. All right. Get you killed. Step five, don't touch. There are more tigers in captivity than there are in the wild. 
In the U.S. alone, there are approximately 5,000 captive tigers, but only 3,900 globally. Oh, wow. Despite what you've seen on TV, tigers are not meant to be pets. Just ask Las Vegas showmen Siegfried and Roy. Their careers were cut short when a white male tiger named Manticore mauled Roy Horn. The tiger dragged Roy's unconscious body backstage in 2003. Animal handler Chris Lawrence believes that the showman had neglected to spend time with the animals for several years. Weakening the necessary bond between the tiger and the performer, many of the handlers thought that Roy was treating the cats more like props. First of all, you're a performer. Why are you playing with them animals? Them things are alive just like us. You gotta be careful, bro. You don't want to mess up your relationship because he gonna eat you or drag you to backstage like he did, man. Don't want to do that. Not at all, bro. He was respecting them for who they were, said Lawrence. There are many different stories about what happened that night, but they all end the same way, with Horn being rushed to the hospital for extensive surgical treatment. Horn lost an enormous amount of blood from the large puncture wounds on his neck and needed brain surgery. Today, Horn is able to walk short distances without his scooter and can talk with difficulty. Although he wasn't physically hurt as a result of the attack, Handler Lawrence experienced severe PTSD, alcoholism, Ooh. night terrors, and suicidal tendencies for 15 years. And remember, Roy Horn and Chris Lo I hope nobody has to go through that. That's just not it. You know, you don't want to go through things like that. That's just not... Ooh, that's ridiculous. ...are both professionals who spent years of their lives working with tigers. Step six. He looked happy don't back then. Myths. Don't believe myths. All right. So I know all the steps, y'all. I know all the steps. First of all, we got to be quiet. You know what I'm saying? Number two. I forgot. Um, <laughs> but I think uh, it was something. Don't pee your pants. Make yourself look big. Uh, and you can't uh, turn your back or something like that. Myths that all cats fear water. Tigers enjoy it. They're oh, great wow. swimmers and enjoy cooling themselves off. So jumping into water will not be a safe place to hide. Step seven. Wow. Climb a tree. They can't climb? Unlike other jungle cats, tigers cannot climb trees. So you may be safe if you climb high enough that the tiger can't reach you. If you encounter a tiger... But first of all, I got to get up the tree. If the tree doesn't have a branch for a little, like, length, uh, how am I going to get up the tree? That That's where it's like, this is unrealistic. I'm dead. Nah, I'm going to make it, though. I'm going to find a way. I'm telling y'all. Escaped from captivity, don't assume it's domesticated and friendly. They are as dangerous as a tiger in the wild. Step eight, fight back. Fight back. Okay. Don't try to play dead. This will make you an easy meal. If a tiger has you in its grips, stick your hand right into its mouth. That'll trigger a gag reflex, stopping it from biting. The good news is, tigers are more afraid of attacking a human than a lion, especially if they aren't familiar with humans and haven't learned how easy it is to catch and kill us. But if you should come across a lion, you'll need some different survival strategies. Okay. Find out more about that right here on How to Survive. Okay. Click like and subscribe. Make sure y'all go check that video because who knows? You might want to know how to survive a lion. I don't, I don't know what you want to know. We might watch it together one day. Let me know if y'all want to see that. <laughs> but we're going to stop that there, y'all. Make sure you give this video a like. Make sure you subscribe for more content. I hope y'all enjoyed it. I'm going to catch y'all on another one. Your boy CJ out. Peace.